Okay, so my name is Kate Errington and I am an IFBB fitness pro. So I compete in fitness competitions where I have to do two rounds of physique round and then a performance routine round, which includes dance, gymnastics, strength skills, cardio. So my training is very varied. Um, I do a mixture of weight training, cardio training, gymnastics training, sort of everything you can think of really. Um, powerlifting as well. I'm actually competing in the British Championships in powerlifting uh, next month, I believe. So I, alongside that, I am a performer as well, professional dancer and singer. And I'm also a coach. So I do my coaching majority online, um, some in-person posing coaching as well. And I coach both competitors for competitions like myself and also non-competitors. So just lifestyle clients, people looking to lose a bit of weight or grow some muscle or just in general, keep fit and healthy. And um, that's pretty much me in a nutshell. Um, so when I started my competitive career, I was uh, in a division called Bikini and that was back in 2014 and I actually decided to take part as a New Year's resolution. So prior to that, I just went to the gym a bit, obviously did all my dancing and then thought, oh, I'll do this as a challenge and ended up winning my first show, which was pretty incredible. And it was a lineup of about 30 girls. And I kind of didn't really have a clue what I was doing, um, but clearly did very well and knew this was gonna be something I was gonna continue. So I competed for a long time as an amateur in bikini um, and I grow muscle very easily. Obviously, I'm, when you're a newbie, those newbie gains are very, very real. So I gained a lot of muscle very quickly and soon outgrew the bikini category and then transferred over to the fitness category, which suits me better anyway because of that performance element. Um, you get more stage time as well doing the um, physique round and then the performance round. So I competed at like the amateur Olympias the amateur Arnold um, and then the highlight of my amateur career was getting to compete at the amateur Arnold in Columbus Ohio in America and I actually won that show and won my pro card which was insane um, and part of your prize because it's such a prestigious competition part of your prize as an amateur if you win the overall is you get to then compete the following year at the Arnold, which is invitation only as a pro. So I had this opportunity already that many people only dream of because um, people apply and apply and apply year after year and don't get invited. And I already had that invite from winning the amateur show. So no pressure going into the pro league. Um, I just wanted to do my best. I just wanted to not look out of place, bring a fun and exciting routine and a physique that I was proud of first and foremost. Um, and I just said, I don't want to come last. And I ended up coming second at my pro debut at the Arnold America. Um, and to be honest, that's probably one of the best moments of my entire career. Um, my coach actually won, so that feeling of being next to her, her winning, me coming second, because um, I genuinely wasn't expecting to come top five. Um, so that was honestly the any video footage you see of that show or any photos, I'm literally like, what? <laughs> like mind blown. So that was amazing. And then two weeks later, I actually then competed at the Arnold Australia and I won that one. So um, my first two pro shows went very, very well and Arnold Schwarzenegger himself gave me my trophy and um, there's a clip um, of us having the interview on stage and he says, um, you know, you came second two weeks ago, you know, why did you win? How did you win this time? And I was like, I don't know. And he said, I know because you are the best. And I was like, right, that's it. I'm done. I can retire now. <laughs> <laughs> it was um, probably, yeah, the, the, the coming second and then that win, they're very like on a par with each other, like they were both incredible moments. So winning that show, I qualified for the Olympia all in my rookie year, um, all happened very, very fast. Um, and that was an amazing experience obviously to make it to the, the Super Bowl of bodybuilding, the Olympia. So to step on that stage um, and again, not come last, um, I was happy with any result really from that show. So then since then I've competed at the Arnold 
several more times. I've come fifth, I've come fourth. Um, this most recent one, I came fourth. Um, I've competed at the Arnold Australia again. Obviously, we had COVID, so didn't really get to compete that year. Um, I've qualified for the Olympia twice since um, and haven't been able to go because of one was COVID, one was because I had um, other plans in life that I wanted to do. Um, so the goal is this year um, to maybe do the Olympia this year, try and qualify for that, um, which would be amazing because yeah, I've qualified three times, but only been once. So I'd like to go uh, at least one more time. So I think that's, yeah, probably all the highlights of my career, they all happen pretty fast, to be honest, so yeah. <laughs>